guys, welcome back to Homeschool in Life. It's Lauren with you here today. And I decided to film a stocking stuffer favorites video. I had thought about filming a what I'm getting my kids in their stockings this year video, but I was a little bit anxious that they might see the video or, you know, just kind of ruin the surprise. And I didn't want to do that this year. So I'm actually just going to share some of our top favorite stocking stuffers that we have received or my kids have received um, in past years. So I have five kids ranging from age 15, a 14 year old down to an 11, nine and six year old. So some of these have been from over the past, you know, few years. Um, so, but I'm in that general, like kind of covering all the ages, except I don't have like a little baby right now, but all of these will be great stocking stuffers for, I have a teenage girl, a teenage boy, and like preteen years down to a early elementary. So I hope, um, there'll be something in here that gives you a great idea or something in this last week before Christmas. If you're out running around looking for those last minute stocking stuffers, maybe this will give you a few ideas. I love watching stocking stuffer videos. Sometimes I'll get to like one kid and I'm like, what do I need to get? And I'll go search up stocking stuffers for a nine year old boy. And I usually can find a great video out there on YouTube that is very helpful. So I'm going to start with my oldest. She is 15. So last Christmas she was 14 and I'm going to share just a few. Um, I just, I have piles here around me. So if I'm reaching or, you know, picking things up and things, that's what I'm doing. But this would be for a preteen to teenage girl, um, gift ideas. So I'm going to just start right out. So my first thing I have is jewelry. So I don't know if this is going to focus back and forth very well, but just some earrings. Oh, one of them fell down. So some cute earrings. My daughter always puts like necklaces or earrings or something like that on her um, wish list for Christmas. So that is definitely a great stocking stuffer idea for a teen or preteen girl if she doesn't have her ears pierced she could do a necklace or a bracelet jewelry probably top thing and another thing would be a fun lotion or body wash or something like that this is bath and body works but any fun scented lotion or body wash is always fun for a preteen girl um, another thing I have is this is I know like super popular right now. I think it's I'm not gonna say the Brazilian crush Perfume Cherie. I don't know. I don't remember what it's called, but this is my daughter's favorite I think it come from Sephora and she actually got this for her birthday But it would be a great stocking stuffer. So perfume or body spray something like that um, another fun thing, if your daughter is into makeup, my daughter does a little bit of makeup, so maybe some mascara or some eyeshadow or something like that, but she doesn't do a lot, but when she does, it's always nice to have some cleanser or these are face wash, um, towelettes that she uses to clean off her mascara. Um, so definitely in that range, you could do... Uh, face wash, you could do uh, lotions and moisturizers, you could do any type of makeup if that's your daughter's thing, but that's another idea I had. Um, another one might be a watch. This is a watch my daughter received, and I know smart watches are really big, and my daughter actually has a smart watch, but just a cute watch jewelry style, you know, kind of, I don't know what you would call this. Um, an accent watch or something like that. That would be a cute um, addition to their stocking. And I have another one here that's a little bit larger. This could actually be a gift or it could be a stocking stuffer depending on how um, big of a stocking you like to do. But the Instapix, uh, it's like a Polaroid. These were super popular a few years ago. My daughter got one. Instapix Mini. Um, that's a fun one. Maybe a case if your daughter already has one to go along with it. Um, those are fun as well. So, and also 
I don't know if I have it here with me, but the film that goes along with it would be a great stocking stuffer if maybe you bought the camera as a gift and you wanted to give something in the stocking to go along with it. The Instapix film would be another great one. And the last thing I had here, I think these are pretty popular right now with girls and teen girls, is pins and paint pins. My daughter, I think this might have been a last, not last Christmas, but a Christmas ago, is the Posca paint pins. Those are fun for art projects. Um, and then the Tomboy brush pins. Tombo, you can tell I'm not really 100% sure. I'm not sure if you can see the this brand, but there it is, maybe. Those brush pins, whoops, dropped that one. And us, the midline, actually the midliner highlighters are a big hit. My daughter uses these a lot for her Bible journaling, so. There they are, midliners, highlighter, and markers. So I think that's all the things I had for my teen daughter. So now we'll move on to my son. So my son, like I said, is 14, just turned 14. Um, so he was 13 last year. Some of these are from last year, but just kind of a preteen to teenage boy, even your husband, you know, these would kind of cross over and go both ways. So one of the main things my son asks for every year, which is funny, but is socks. So these are some socks I got along with, maybe I know the Nike crew socks are super popular and um, those are another great gift idea for teen boys. Um, another thing is uh, if your son is like outdoorsy, like mine is, maybe some fishing or hunting paraphernalia. So he's really into um, these mystery, I'm not sure if you can read it or not, mystery tackle boxes. You can find these at Walmart. This would be a great um, gift idea. It just comes with several like fishing things and he really enjoys just, I guess you get more than your money's worth out of it. Like you, it's worth $25, but you spend 20 maybe on it. So those are just some fun things and they come, or if you just wanted to buy individual, like I'm not sure what these are, lures, worms, things like this come in it. So that's a fun idea if you have an outdoorsy um, son. Another thing that my boys have gotten and loved are flashlights and lanterns. This is one that they use all the time. So this could go for big boy, teenage boy, or a younger boy as well. Um, another thing my teenage son got is a flag football kit. This is a fun game, especially if they're into sports, which he is also, but they like to play football, but maybe you don't want them like getting hurt with their friends and things. So a flag football set is nice to have. And another thing that would be cool is earbuds. Um, these are actually my earbuds, but my son and my daughter both have earbuds. So that is a good gift for a teenager. Okay, guys, I'm back. I was interrupted for a minute. A kid needed me, so. Back to my teen son. Another thing, this is actually my daughter's, but it could go boy or girl, is a portable charger. Um, if they have their own phone, um, or maybe a device or headphones or anything that they needed to charge um, when they're out and about. A portable charger is great. I love having a portable charger. And another thing I had was a Bluetooth speaker. This is one that we own, but they come in all shapes, sizes, price ranges. Um, portable chargers, are, or I mean, portable speakers, I'm sorry, are great too, Bluetooth speakers. Uh, my kids love them. They've got some going all over the place outside when they're playing basketball or um, with their friends, maybe playing football. They like to set up a Bluetooth speaker or in their rooms listening to audiobooks and things like that. So those are some ideas for a teen or preteen boy or even your husband. Those would be great ideas. Okay, moving on to my younger um, boys. Um, could be, some of these could be girl or boy, but here are just a few ideas for the younger crowd. Um, Play-Doh, always a great stocking stuffer in our house, Play-Doh. And even my 
11 year old still likes to play with play-doh so play-doh is a great gift idea the next thing i have this was actually a stocking stuffer from last year is a perler bead set now not everyone is pro perler beads but we like them in our house and i have a very artsy son who um is really into crafting and so he got this in his stocking last year was a set of this star wars perler beads that's another um, great gift that can kind of go from a younger range, not too young because it could be a choking hazard, but a younger age range up to even older kids like perler beads. So another option. Here is another option you might have is one of these small little Lego sets. That's a great option for a boy or girl. You can go either way, do Lego friends or something like that. Um, I already shared the lantern or flashlight, but just another idea. Here is one that one of my sons might be getting in their stocking this year. Um, this was a new one idea that I had come across. Um, my boys love to get my iPhone and turn on the stopwatch and time themselves in different scenarios or situations, races, some of their games and things like that. So a stocking stuffer idea that I saw and I thought I would share here too is a stopwatch. So. Pretty cool idea for a young boy or girl that loves racing and playing outside. It's kind of an out of the box idea, um, but I think my kids will be pretty excited about a stopwatch. Um, and some more practical ideas too. This could be teens all the way down to younger ones are gloves. We live in the South north south central south area so it gets cold it's not freezing so i'm sure if you were more north than us you would need some more heavy duty cold gear but just some cotton gloves um we do have snow gloves too and we've bought those or some beanies hoodies this is a three pack that i picked up that i'm going to split up for some of my kids so those are some of my younger kid ideas Okay, last thing I'm going to share today before I lose all my daylight is card games or I guess you could say board games as well. You could totally, we do stocking stuffers that are bigger than the stocking and keep them in, we wrap them and put them beside the stocking. Totally do that and it would work great. These are some things though that do fit in a stocking if you're more inclined to just want to stuff a stocking and not have wrapped gifts around it or things like that. So I picked mostly some card games. This would be more for your younger crowd. Little ones, Spot It, fun game. We like Spot It, my bigger ones play it too. Um, just a set of fun playing cards. I got these for one of my kids last year. It's fun just for like go fish and we actually taught them to play Rummy, but they like the Minecraft ones. They think those are fun. Another one of my kids at Christmas or so ago received Monopoly Deal. This is a fun one that we enjoy playing with. One of our all time favorite card games, Exploding Kittens. This company is kind of fun. They have a lot of different ones. Um, it says it's like Uno, except there are goats, magical enchiladas, and kittens that kill you. So I don't know if you've heard of this company before, but they make some very interesting games. I was trying to remember the name. I'm not seeing it, but I saw they have another one called Zombie Kittens or something like that. And we have a few of their other games, but anyway, it's a big favorite in our house. This is another one for my older kids, but the little ones actually can play it too is Koo. It's a fun card game. And then this is one we got last year, Cover Your Assets. It's kind of a commodity type game, so it's fun. This is another one, Sleeping Queens. Another favorite in our house. It's a game right game. We have a few of those. And this one's been around for a long time. I'm pretty sure I thrifted this one. It wasn't a stocking stuffer, but I actually saw it at our TJ Maxx the other day. And so it's out there. It's called Play Nine, and it's a card game um, that our family has played for years and years. So those are just a few of the card games that our family are just really popular in our family and we really enjoy. 
So that is all of my stocking stuffer ideas for this season. Um, just some fun things that I think would make great gifts for your kids. So I hope that was helpful for you and that you're able to get some ideas if you have some last minute shopping to do before the holidays were a week from Christmas. So I actually finished up my stockings last week and I'm super excited to have that over with. But thank you so much for joining us here during this holiday season and we hope to see you here again soon. Bye guys.